My name is Nelson Wanaka, and I'm a co-director with the Colorado chapter of The Cure Starts Now. Um, I was a parent of a child with brain tumor who went through your facility at Children's Hospital, and it was a wonderful place for her to be and and just an amazing you know team over there. Uh, in 30 seconds or less, doctor, can you just encapsulate in layman's terms what the research grant you're looking for, like what your proposal is? Yeah, so the, the short, short version is that um, we are looking at ways that tumors read and write from DNA to make proteins to grow. And a lot of those proteins they make, we know are really core to what causes cancer, but drugging those proteins themselves has proven really hard. So we have a roundabout way of doing that by hitting how they're made. Um, and we have a drug in particular that seems to do that well. And we've got a pharmaceutical company buy-in who's interested in moving that forward in pediatrics. And we're looking um, to try and figure out the right diseases and the right kids to test that in. Um, is my shortest short version of, of where we're at and what we're doing. Well, I appreciate it. And that sounds like something that's very important and very necessary. And I want to tell you that your grant request has been approved for $100,000, doctor. That's awesome. That is that is fantastic. That's, that's for, really great to hear. For MIC-driven circuitry in medulloblastoma. And so we are so thankful to you for doing this type of work. It's absolutely necessary. And congratulations, doctor. Well, thank you. Thank you. That's that's really awesome um, to hear. And, and I appreciate your guys' support and, and your involvement. Um, I, I met her only briefly when she was was here at our, our facility in our care, but it's it is very neat to see these these th things come full circle. Yeah, and I, right now I'd like to turn it over to Brooke Georgia. Hi, Dr. Dahl. Congratulations on your grant. Thank you. Um, I'm Brooke George. Um, I have a chapter here in North Dakota in honor of my son, Connor. He had Medjolo. Um, so I'm a Medjolo mom myself and also the Medjolo Family Support Coordinator for The Cure Starts Now. Um, I know that MIC amplification is a hot topic, you know, with being involved in the Medjolo world. Can you briefly tell us, you know, how this is impactful and do you think this study is pertinent to other type of brain cancers as well? Yes, I do. Um, so I, I thought this was a, a really interesting um, collaboration between um, the DAPG consortium and Cure Starts Now. And I, I'll admit, I'm still not 100% sure how those two intertwine and overlap with this. Um, but the the way that we are are looking at um, targeting transcription as a way of drugging targets that are otherwise hard to drug, I think is relevant in a lot of different cancers. Um, this actually came out of work from this drug um, that we are proposing in clinical trial right now um, through the Pediatric Brain Tumor Consortium for DIPG and other high-grade gliomas. Um, and have been exploring how it might be relevant in, in other tumors like MIC-driven medullo. So MIC-driven medullos, I, I think, are the most promising other um, tumor or model that, that we've seen it in. Um, but you're right, a lot of people are really interested in, in how to get at MIC and, and how um, some of these transcriptional dependencies might be a way to do that. Um, so I think that, you know, this is... I, I'm personally interested in medulloblastoma because that's that's what we do. But I think that there's there's obviously a lot of other MIC-driven tumors where this biology is very relevant for outside of that. Sure. Well, like Nelson said, your work is very important. Um, we are very thankful for everything that you are doing. And just on behalf of the Cure Starts Now, um, we just thank you. We're very appreciative. Well, oh, that, that's that's. Amazing to hear and, and thank you guys. I, I appreciate your support and your, you know, help being part of this.